most of the things that I did uh, and do as an editor is always very instinctual. It's just that I have, I have a great sense of uh, belief in rhythm and clarity as far as editing is concerned. Uh, I believe that each scene has its own rhythm. I mean, you don't, uh, you can't just drop a really quick cut into a love scene and expect the audience to be aware of it. You, you set the audience up for a certain pace in a movie. Not that, all the, not that all the cuts have to be the same length, but they have to have a certain flow to them. And if you interrupt that flow, you're interrupting the audience's concentration and they kind of lose it for a little bit. Uh, I'd, I'm definitely a believer in clarity. Uh, as a matter of fact, in my acceptance speech for the uh, Career Achievement Award, I'm, I mentioned that uh, in this position, people are frequently asked to make some sort of sage advice to other editors, and the thing that I said was, um, don't cut too fast. Don't mistake, don't mistake confusion for kinetics. It's fine to be fast cutting, uh, to cut quickly, because you need to in a fight. And those kinds of things happen. In a gunfight, in a shootout, in a chase, quick cuts are important, but you can make them so quick, you can't tell who's fighting or who's winning or anything until somebody's lying bleeding on the floor, you know? And then the thing that gets me is we nominate them for Academy Awards and vote for them, you know. And to me, some of that stuff is some of the worst edited stuff in the world. When you cut, if you don't understand or you're not clear as to who's doing what to whom, uh, how can it be called good editing, you know?